that for us. Thank you. Major changes coming for Arizona's two largest universities and their athletic programs. The University of Arizona and Arizona State are leaving the Pac-12 conference and joining the Big 12 beginning 2024. Today we're hearing from ASU President Michael Crow and Athletic Director Ray Anderson who explained why this was a move that the Sun Devils had to make to stay competitive. 12 Sports' Lena Washington has the latest from Tempe. This morning's Sun Devil football practice had a couple special guests out here. ASU President Michael Crow and Athletic Director Ray Anderson speaking with local media after what's been an eventful 48 hours in conference realignment. This comes after the big announcement that ASU will be moving from the Pac-12 to the Big 12 beginning next fall. So this time next year, it will be a new era in athletics for the Sun Devils. How do we feel about the destruction of the Pac-12 and what do we feel about our responsibility for that? We were the stalwarts fighting for the Pac-12 until the last ditch. We were trying to save it and stayed in the trenches as long as we could until it became clear that it was no longer in our control. Yesterday morning at 7 a.m. was another called meeting of the uh, Pac-12 presidents and some schools didn't show up. So you might know that then therefore the conference is no longer viable. Over the course of just 10 days, six schools have defected from the Pac-12. Once Oregon and Washington announced their move to the Big Ten, Crow and Anderson knew they had to act fast, applying for and being accepted into the Big 12 in a matter of hours. It made a lot more sense for the student athlete experience uh, and competitive uh, to get into the Big 12. Because we've talked to our coaches, a number of them, particularly uh, in the Olympic sports. They couldn't be more pleased. Bobby Hurley couldn't be more pleased. Kenny couldn't be more pleased. We are being admitted as a full founding member, as the original eight of the Big Eight. I'm a former Big Eight athlete. I was a javelin thrower at Iowa State. I went to all those schools, Stillwater, Manhattan, Lawrence. One thing Crow and Anderson stressed was their commitment to maintaining the tradition of competing against in-state rival Arizona, as the Wildcats are also Big 12 bound in 2024. Arizona and Arizona State decided we wouldn't split up under any circumstance. ASU kicks off its last season in the Pac-12, coming up on August 31st against Southern Utah here in Tempe. I'm Lena Washington, 12 Sports. Lena, thanks for sorting that out for us. A lot to unpack there.